Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, let's pick up some best and worst bags from Chanel 23S, which is a spring summer act 2 collection. This collection is going to be released on March 14, 2023. At the beginning of this video, I also have some small leather goods pieces from this collection that you can take a look first. To be honest, I haven't seen a lot of bags from this collection that I can consider they are the best. Therefore, I picked some bags that you may consider if you want to buy it. I made this video last month and Chanel just had a price increase in March. So the price you see on this video are old price. Let's start with the number one. 20cc. 20cc still can consider as a classic bag and they come every other season. So this time they also come with the large size and the regular size, both sizes made by lambskin. Number 2. Chanel 22 bag. The most popular bag from this season will be the Chanel 22 mini size. Let's see how popular this one gonna be from this season. Number three, Chanel Chin on Chin. This is the seasonal bag. It come out two sizes, both sizes made by aged goat skin. I never seen aged goat skin in the past. So this time we will check it out how durable this leather it is. Number four, another new seasonal bag called Double U. This bag made by aged calf skin leather. It comes with three sizes. It also comes with a denim material. Number five, another new seasonal bag called Carry Me. This bag made by Caviar Leather, it comes with uh, two sizes. The bag style it seems like you can use it as an everyday bag, it looks very professional. This season doesn't have a lot of uh, Caviar Leather, so this is a wonderful Caviar Leather. Number six. Another seasonal bag called Fancy Jewel, made by Lambskin, come out of two sizes. One is the large size and the one is the small size. Number seven. New seasonal bag called Chin Strap Bag. Come out of two sizes and made by Cow Skin Leather. Number 8. Sweet Camellia. This time they come with a whole collection and I group them together. They are including the mini square, mini rectangular, small flop, messenger bag, vanity case, and a wallet on the chin. However, they are all made by lambskin leather. Number 9. Urban Spirit Backpack. This bag they come two sizes. One is a large one, one is a small one. And they made by Caviar Leather, which I would recommend it. It looks very practical and it has a good capacity. It's good for the backpack. Number 10. Graphic Catch. 
There's also new seasonal bag made by aged calf skin leather. It come out of three sizes. Last one is a bonus one. It is Golden Lynx, made by Lambskin Leather. I'm not so sure if anyone liked the handle, so let's just put it this way. Let's move on to next category, the bag that are not recommended at all. First one is the Holy Wood. This bag is more like a collective piece. Not a very practical, it's a very expensive one. Number two, another seasonal bag called Charm Me, made by Lambskin Leather, come out of two sizes. I put it as a not recommend bag because of the chain. I just don't like the chain with the plastic pieces on that. It looks very cheap. Next one is a clutch with chain. The reason not recommended because of the price tag. Next one is a W backpack in the dental material. I will definitely not recommend it to go for the dental material for the backpack, but you can consider lesser version. Next one is shining cocoa. The reason I don't recommend it because of the pattern leather. That's the only leather they come out. And I never recommend anyone to buy the pattern leather because it needs high maintenance. The other reason of the pattern leather, they just don't look expensive. Next one is a Coco Love. This bag comes two sizes, the mini size and the small size. However, I don't recommend it because the turn log. Now without the heart surrounding the turn log CC, I think that will be the nice one. However, put it on the heart surrounding the CC, I just feel it's a very childish and doesn't look very classic for a Chanel bag with that. Uh, I don't know, maybe a lot of people is not going to agree with me. They also come with the Coco Love Bucky bag. Same reason, I just don't like the CC logo with the heart on that. Next one is the Fancy Jewel. So they also come out the buggy bag. Uh, the reason I don't recommend it, of course, the price tag. So the last one is the evening bags. There are a couple of them, which they are very pricey. So that's all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you in the next video. Thanks. Bye bye.